Good morning. We've already started the morning out well with with Mary wetting her pants this morning. Don't ask me what's up with that. I guess she just didn't make it to the toilet. Usually she's outstanding with that, but not today. Tomorrow I'm going to finish my math. Look, look at right there. See? There's that page that I'm going to do and that page. And then tomorrow is that page and that page. The next day is that page and that page. Yeah, not very much. Not very much. This red pen costs 88 cents. Okay, um, okay. We're playing 75? math today and money in school. Money. That's right, Mary's got money too. 75. Um, 76, mommy, 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 $2. How do you do $2? Well, they don't uh -huh. teach this in your... No. Look on your one coin. You yes, $2. Yeah. Yes. No, no, no. Yes. We're using coins. Yes. All right. You are the proud owner of this book. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Now let's try something different. Ready? I'm going to give you, Peter, $3. Mommy. You need to give me change. How much? Ah, how are we going to do this? Two dollars and thirteen cents. How much change do you have to give me? How much Come change on. do I have to give her? I don't know. No, 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 no. Oh. How much, how change, much change, change do you have to give me? Okay, so $3. here's how we do it. Okay, so we're starting at two thirteen. We got to work up to three dollars. There's African mommy Americans. and Peter. Some new Americans did we not did choose this. to make America their home. Many African people were forced to what leave their are you homes reading? and to come home as slaves. What are you reading? This is Peter's history book, Our America, and he's almost done with it. Oh. I'm going to be done. And well, look, there's a couple more pages yep. left, too. See? Almost How many done. pages do we have? Oh, there's maybe 15 pages left. 15? Yeah. That's a lot. She's up. Actually, it's four o'clock and the other girls are still sleeping, which is like totally amazing. Yeah. I was able to get a whole video edited and at least I started the process of uploading. I'm not sure it'll get done anytime soon. Um, but progress, we're making progress. And the big kids have gone over to my neighbors in the woods behind our house. A tree fell down and he needed some help moving some of that wood. Uh, he spent the morning cutting it down and chopping it up into smaller pieces, but he really needed the manpower. So that's where they are, getting some good fresh air and exercise, and that's how I got my video edited. But last night the wind was absolutely crazy. It was like gusting, like mad, wasn't it? Did you sleep through it? She goes, I didn't hear a thing. I'm gonna try to quick pick up the living room before Art comes home. You can see it's a little messy, not too bad, but I always would like to have it tidied up before he comes in and that's one of the first things he can see is the mess. It's always good to get him off on a good note when he comes home so he doesn't have that stress of trying to get the house in order because the kids Dad. have been chaotic all day, right? Do you want to help? You want to help mommy pick up the living room? You're okay, let's go. I just got back from the post office and nothing in the P.O. box. But today in the mail, we did, I got this um, thing here for a back of books. And if any of you guys do use a back of books, I don't know if you guys are aware that there are usually a back of book shows almost across the country. And when you go there, there's some perks to going. First of all, you get to see the materials before you buy it. But also, secondly, they usually offer free shipping, which is a big deal for me. And then on this, for one, bleh, for this year, they're doing 10% off 
Textbook orders over 75, or if you have a bigger load, they're doing 15% off orders of 350 or more. So really, those are some really great ways to do savings. And if you don't get one of these flyers here, just go to Abeka Books. I think it's abekabooks.com and type in book show schedule or something. They'll prompt you for your zip code and you can check out to see where your local book shows are because it really is a good way to save some money and also check out the books before you buy them. Elle's gone to the ambulance building. Yeah. She's on call right now. So mm -hmm. the kids and I cleaned up the house and we're enjoying a little snack of uh, raisins, pecans, and chocolate chips. Yeah. The way it works is you move your ships around the board and as you get to port you pick up the cards and you get your money for your uh, for your cargo and then the cloud moves around the board and it sucks up it has little magnets in it And then the magnets go over the ships and they suck up the ships if they're ill-placed <laughs> It's facing a jeep and the kids the kids like this game What do you like about this game John? I like the hearing the clink of a ship going down getting caught in the storm. But not your ship yeah. Charity's going to spin it. What do we go, get? I'll go the way facing A. So you turn it like this. The points points are always have to point north. Wait, you know. There. Nobody gets sucked up. You got north all the way. I'm facing E. We'll see if John gets sucked up. John is safe, but just barely. His ship is underneath the storm, but he didn't get sucked up, though. I'm safe for now. For this move. We went through our rounds, and we're moving it again. Let's see. Oh, I heard the clunk. Hey! Hey! Peter, stop it! Oh, John's ship is no longer there. Well, neither are Peter's and Daddy's, but they were in home port, so they don't get No, they were just in port. They were wow. in port, so... Those ones are in port, so they were safe. But John's is not safe. It is gone. Poor John. John is down to three ships. I saw three ships come sailing in on Christmas Day and Christmas Day. Okay, we got east facing G. Uh-oh, this isn't looking good. We have a whole... Bunch of ships in the way. Quiet, everybody. Listen for the clicks. Oops. Ah. <laughs> Keep going. Yeah. Three ships down. <laughs> oh, no. Don't get me. Don't get me. Go get me. The magnet's so full, I can't even pick up Peter's last <laughs> one. <laughs> No, no, it didn't get. Picked no, up. if it doesn't get picked up, it doesn't get picked up. Okay, John well then, lost two. Okay, Peter's ship is right underneath the storm. What? Nobody got. Nobody clear. got it. And he gets sucked up. Yes! I got sucked up. <laughs> <laughs> he got sucked up. No, I didn't. <laughs> yes, yep. did. Peter and Lydia. John has one ship Three. left. I have Three. four. Four, uh oh, five, John has no ships. Six, seven, seven, Daddy eight, wins. Nine, ten. I don't win. John wins. What? How did Daddy not get sucked up? I don't know. Close enough to the cloud. Wow. So Daddy has four ships. Nobody else has any. The only problem is you win by getting the most oh, amount of money, and I don't have very much I money. Think you had one of the Maybe. Oh, yeah. Daddy. You mm -hmm. could get all the rest. If I can get those without getting sucked up. Oh, Dad, that's going to be painful. I know it is. I had four ships going around the board when everyone else's was gone. The only problem is I didn't get enough money, so even though even though I had four ships, John won. Yes. It's time to head to bed. Janelle got a call, and it was a pregnancy-related call, which makes her very happy. She loves pregnancy calls. And she doesn't get too many, so when she gets one, she's delighted about it. I got the house neatened up, and I'm going to start to head to bed now. Good night, and remember to like the video, tell your friends, all that good stuff. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye. And one more thing I forgot to tell you about. Uh, since it's the beginning of the month, March 1st, uh, we were going to start our new Snail's Pace Challenge. But, uh, well, anyway, we didn't get around to it. So tomorrow... We're going to tell you about our new Snail's Pace Challenge for the month of March.